Hey guys, what's up Pisces? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. So we're going to do a love reading to see where things are currently. We're going to look at some oracle cards and then we're going to do a feelings reading to see how you're feeling, how the person on your mind is feeling, and the outcome of those feelings. All right, Pisces, so remember the energies can always be reversed. Flip it how you need to. Also remember it's a general reading. So just take what's yours and leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. All right, Pisces, let's get started. What's going on? currently around Pisces for love please all right you have truth seeking you will discover the truth about the situation soon and you also have trust issues trust issues are affecting the connection it kind of feels like for some this truth seeking like somebody's going through a phone somebody may you know not really be very trusting what the other person is up to kind of checking out social media Doing a little bit of, you know, kind of what you up to energy. You also have third party. A third party is interfering with your relationship. So for some of those trust issues, there may be um, a reason to have those issues. But for some also, it's uh, truth seeking. That may soon be coming to light. You have fear of loss fear of loss keeps you from moving on so for some this may be like a reoccurring situation something you know that's happened before but there's this fear of kind of pulling away and sometimes that can be even subconsciously you have divine timing everything will work when the universe sees fit so I guess that's kind of, you know, that's kind of comforting. Divine time and that's Jupiter energy. That's the wheel, wheel energy. Just make sure that you're not, you know, um, don't take, I mean, don't let anyone take you for granted. You, all, you have leveling up. This connection is moving to the next level. So it feels like when the time is right, you already have divine timing on your side, having your back there. Um the things are it feels, it feels like they're going to work out because of the leveling up forbidden love this relationship is frowned upon by many so for some it's not even just like the trust issues or things kind of going on in the background you may have family and friends in your ear kind of telling you to move on or vice versa but fear of loss keeps somebody um keeps you from loving or vice versa I mean, somebody could, you know, have a fear of kind of letting go of something. Self-centered, preoccupied with the interest of self. All right, Pisces. So let's just see what the current feelings are. Because we have a lot of, you know, somebody's trying to find out the truth. There may be a lot of insecurities or having a hard time, like, feeling secure within the relationship. There may be a third party, but that doesn't necessarily mean, like, cheating. That could be somebody's family or somebody's friends, like, always in their ear. Um, but you do have fear of loss. Fear of loss keeps you from loving. So, you know, somebody may have really been holding back for a while, but everything's going to come through as divine time you sees. You know, it's already like it's there. It's got your back. So um, it feels like when this truth seeking comes out, that allows the connection to kind of move um, and things to progress. But we do have, you know, the relationship is frowned upon by many self-centered, preoccupied with interests of self. So, you know, even those around you may not feel like you're getting all that you deserve within this connection. All right, Pisces, let's see what the feelings are between you and the person on your mind. How is Pisces feeling? How is the person on their mind feeling? Oh, somebody's very protective of heart right now, of self. May could kind of be more like business focused or just kind of <clears throat> a little bit more protective of just like putting feelings out there and kind of letting down a wall, letting down a guard and, and letting things kind of come together. All right, so how is Pisces feeling, please? Thank you. 
You have the moon. Gemini has that same card right there. This person, ooh, the Ten of Swords. It may be feeling like it's over. With the moon there, that's Cancer Pisces energy. So you could, that, you know, I'm reading this one as your energy. Um, it can't always be reversed, but what is the... <laughs> All right, um, two ways this is going, right? Because it's coming across like you've got options, but we go from the Ten of Swords to the Ace of Cups. For some, um, this, this may be like a rekindle, but for some, you also may kind of be moving on to something new. We go from the Ten of Swords to the Ace of Cups, so um, beginnings to endings. I mean, sorry, endings to beginnings. Show me this moon for how Pisces is feeling. So with the moon, um, that does represent like deep feelings, deep emotions, but sometimes with the moon, we keep that to ourselves. So with the two of swords here, it feels like they're, you know, things may kind of feel like they're at a crossroads, like hard to find a resolve, hard, hard to move forward or to be like open to things, especially with this trust issues here. Sometimes this uh, two of swords, we can kind of like block off our heart chakras. Um, and it, there's that lack of trust that comes with that, but also sometimes like codependent or addictive relationships. Um, yeah, see, there's the seven of swords. Something may have gotten revealed here. And when we have the seven of swords, the ace of swords, and this five of swords, it's almost like somebody's hell bent to either find something out or there's something around this that's all the way getting revealed and it's coming across as your side so when we had truth seeking over here um you're about you will discover the truth about a situation soon uh and the five and the seven of swords somebody may kind of and this is a this is a sneaky energy so we do have something um you know it, it feels like it's it's coming to light and it may leave somebody, um, show me this Ten of Swords, feeling betrayed around it. Yeah, somebody, there's, there is spying here. For some, there's gossip as well. But with the Six of Pentacles as well, it's kind of like divided time. Like somebody may, they may feel like it's, um, there was two sides to it. Somebody's giving it two sides here. But you, you have, you have like a very specific story that's kind of going on here. Feels like some guards are up, the seven of cups, the nine of wands. Whoever is registering over here, you have a very specific story. It looks like somebody's kind of cutting out with no longer serving them because something is getting revealed. You have spying, you have gossip, so be mindful of who you're telling your business to. But, um... You know, there there's still a lot of confusion that's lying around this. So it, it there does feel like there's some skepticism, um, or you know, like these trust issues, like the oracle was saying. That was those. Show me this outcome for Pisces, please. We have the three of wands, the ace of cups, the four of swords. Well, that's cool because that's about healing, um, and it does feel like you know there's still an overflowing amount of emotions here. Tell me more about the outcome for Pisces. Um, we went through all this and then ending with the Four of Swords. There's a lot of peace that's found. The feelings are real. The feelings are legit. You may have options as well. For some, there could have been, there could be like some arguments, some argumentative communication. This person is trying to, it, it does look like as a result, the feelings are there. But somebody has taken some time to focus on self, to heal, to recover. With the Ace of Cups and the um, the Nine of Pentacles, that is a, a card of being single. But this is all about self-love here as a result of it. But like I said, the, the feelings, they're legit. But there's something else going on around this connection. And it comes all around something that's that's getting revealed here that's kind of getting found out for some like somebody especially with this page of swords um somebody could kind of like be like i said checking up but also there could be gossip or somebody kind of like asking asking questions trying to find out information 
All right, Pisces, I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that information's below as well. You guys take care, and I will see you next time. Bye.